All right, and now we're here with Madeline. When we go to talk about Madeline, the care and concern about the consumer and how she um, um, interacts with product, it's much different than how we discuss Nicole. The Madeline consumer is very interested in fashion and she's interested in that fashion being delivered into a way that's really widespread for her. So what we do is we take um, silhouettes and lasts and heel shapes and toe shapes that are very understandable and we adorn them with uppers that really start to talk about the specific trends that are going on in the marketplace. And for this season, for fall, winter um, 07, for Madeline, we have selected the three hottest trends that we feel she's going to relate to the best. The first trend is 80s glamour. This trend is going to be identified in booties, both in patent and in leathers, partnered up with the classic pump. We had a very positive reaction to the metallics, especially in this mirror. The mirror is almost a tease in to how we're going to blow it out for spring, 08. This is going to become very prominent in sandals for next, um, for next spring and for this fall winter you're going to see it in classic looks like this pump. We feel this, these two packages merchandise really, really well together and will make a nice display at retail. When you start to look at this booty, especially in the gray, it's very young, it's very junior, it's very fresh and fast. When you look at this same silhouette, detailed in leathers, it becomes a little bit more widespread and understandable for a more core consumer. So when you're merchandising and talking about Madeline, I think it's important to almost display the shoes out for the buyers in two different ways. One on a really fresh and fast way, and the second on a bit of a more core way. And the same goes for the pumps. In these mirrored metallics, it's very junior, it's very young. In the patents, in the darker colors, some of them will transition in decor, as will the leathers. Unfortunately, I don't have all of the colors here with me, so when you lay yours out, you'll know what I'm talking about. The leathers go more core, the metallics and the mirrored patents go more fast, fresh junior. This look is going to be worn with a lot of mini skirts and leggings and oversized tops bangled jewelry, a lot of pop color. You may see her adorned in all blacks and grays with hot pink, yellow, green, neon colored bangles um, and um, pop nail polishes and some of the really enameled looks. When you, when you take note of the patents, you'll note how enameled they are and you're going to see that same look in chain detailing both on shoes and in accessories um, and handbags. This is another look um, when I was in Austin, Texas at South by Southwest. Um, a lot of the young girls were sporting this sort of a very classic 80s look. And even at the show, in the New York show for Fanny, um, a lot of the editors and a lot of the buyers that um, cross the board into the younger, more fashionable consumers were wearing this look. So I'm anxious to see if you guys are able to get a response on this kind of product. It is quite fast, um, detailed especially in the Roman cherry way and some of the patents, and again transitioning to more of a core consumer done in the chocolates. Um, this lends itself very well as I was talking earlier about the mini skirts and the leggings and the rock and roll t-shirts, denim jackets, big oversized necklaces, a lot of enameled and lacquered looks and accessories. You'll also see the enameled look that we were talking about that translates in on the patents as well on the chain detail on this flat. This is fun, it's a dressy flat, it transitions into daytime and evening looks for that 24-7 look of fashion that the Madeline consumer is definitely looking for. So the 80's glamour girl, the sort of rock chic look, um, very popular. You'll see a lot of the um, keywords notated on the base of your trend sheets that you'll all be able to download and print off so that you'll be able to tell this story and merchandise the line out in a very impactful way.